We're now in the first week of Lent. Many people give up something for Lent and it might well be that you've chosen to do this too. I always give up alcohol and chocolate for Lent, so if you see me with either of those in the next six weeks or so, do feel free to remind me of my Lenten discipline and tell me off. But I think sometimes it's even more important to take up something for Lent. And we often want to take up an extra spiritual discipline, perhaps some spiritual reading, reading a short amount of a spiritual book every day, or adding to our prayer time, or even committing to pray privately every day, um, when sometimes we're perhaps so busy that we don't manage that in our normal lives. One thing we might want to do is commit to praying for peace daily. Today also happens to be the first anniversary of Russia's invasion of Ukraine. And I have a prayer here that was written a year ago by our archbishops of Canterbury and York for the people of Ukraine. And I am going to commit to praying this every day during Lent. God of peace and justice, we pray for the people of Ukraine today. We pray for peace and the laying down of weapons. We pray for all those who fear for tomorrow, that your spirit of comfort would draw near to them. We pray for those with power over war or peace, for wisdom, discernment and compassion to guide their decisions. Above all, we pray for all your precious children at risk and in fear, that you would hold and protect them. We pray in the name of Jesus, the Prince of Peace. Amen.